Somebody please get this man some help. The woman officer that was in the news for the last past two weeks slept with six of her co-workers. Got high speed trains ran on her. Her husband came out and said he is going to stay with her. They is in a small community, the city that they in. Now, I'm going to tell you right now, guys like this, we got to start killing guys like this off. Because these niggas have lost their goddamn mind. And he ain't even no nigga, but he done lost his mind. You see, he might be about to get a TV deal or something. If he getting a deal out of this, about to make some money off this, I can completely understand why the hell he about to stay. But this bitch got a hairline going forward, back as far as Whitaker. Who the fuck is she to just be running around here sleeping with six different niggas like that? She even slept with that canine unit nigga. The nigga that patrolled with the dogs. I don't even think he got a real job. So listen, I believe this man is in shock. I believe he needs some therapy. He needs some help. Or either he about to get some type of movie deal off this. Ain't no way he knew. This woman was getting high speed trains ran on her by her co workers. Ain't no way. So I'm looking at it two ways. Either this man got a deal coming, or if not, if it ain't no deal coming, he is so embarrassed by the world knowing this shit that he's just trying to make this shit look good till he get a plan together. But ain't no fucking way he just knew. Hey, look, yeah, they got some white folks and some people out there that's freaky, okay? But typically, when you catch them people being super freaky, where it's going to be a train or a game bang, it's going to typically, a lot of times, be they sticking with their race. It ain't going to be a mixture of all the races. This woman had every type in, in her game bang. White, black, Mexican, a canine. She had everybody there. So all I'm saying is this right here. I believe he's embarrassed. He don't know how to handle it. And he just fucking lost. And I also believe he must got a deal coming from this shit. About to get a talk show. About to get some form of money or endorsement. He about to maybe start on the fans or something. Something about to happen for him to say, I'm about to do this. This right here is a prime example. Oftentimes, well, unless it's a certain situation, you have a real amazing woman on your hand. I disagree with a lot of niggas getting married. Because this nigga business is out in the streets and public knowledge. So you got to realize the white guys in his peer group, no matter what they say face to face, going to look at him like he a bitch ass nigga. He pussy. They just going to look at it in their own terms. But that's basically how they going to look at him. Unless he was in the know and he was like the quarterback of this situation, they going to still judge him, his family members, his friends. And look at him like he ain't shit. Ain't, no, ain't nobody you know around him in this media circle really going to see there and be like, oh, God, this is a great idea. She done caused public shame. Six officers fired. And you was in some small city. So, hey. Uh, some guys seen some guys say, oh, he's a better man than me, this, that, and the other. Nah, this nigga might just be so embarrassed and so dumbfounded by the situation, he might not know what the fuck to do. Because ain't nothing honorable or respectable about it because he's making himself look like a damn fool. Unless they got different marriage vows, she broke the marriage vows. And unless this nigga already was in agreement with it, this shit dead. Now, we're going to get this nigga some therapy, but guys like him... But that type of mindset is the exact type of niggas that need to be killed off. White, black, green, yellow, any race. He's the type of man, the men that are stronger got to get together and just kill them off. And wipe their ass off the face of the earth. Because this shit don't make no sense. What sense do that make? If it makes sense to y'all, you tell me in the comment section.